Pachacuti leads the Inca in Civilization VI Gathering Storm. Though many of the details of his remarkable reign are lost to history, Pachacuti led the expansion of Cusco into the organized and powerful Incan Empire. The Inca's unique improvement is the terrace farm. These can only be placed on hills and provide food, plus additional food for adjacent mountains. Terrace farms also provide production for adjacent aqueducts and fresh water. The Inca's unique ability is mita, which allows citizens to work mountain tiles. Mountain tiles provide production as well as food for adjacent terrace farms. The Warak Ak is the Inca's unique unit. This medieval reconnaissance unit can attack twice in a turn if it hasn't used all of its movement points. Pachacuti's unique ability is Kapak Nyan. Domestic trade routes get additional food for mountains in the origin city. He also has access to the Kapak Nyan improvement, an early version of the new mountain tunnel, after discovering foreign trade. For the Inca, mountain tiles are more than just great defenses. Pachacuti's unique ability, along with plenty of terrace farms, means the Inca will truly thrive in their sprawling mountain cities. As Pachacuti, you can lead your civilization without worrying too much about outside influence. Internal trade routes are stronger than ever, making this a great isolationist civilization. Will your civilization reach its peak in the mountains? How will you lead the Inca in Sid Meier's Civilization VI Gathering Storm?